We have taken objective out. Hello everybody, this is No Remorse and today we are playing Battlefield 1. And in this video I'm gonna be showing you guys off Loop Co Pass, the new DLC map we have taken for those premium job. owners only. This is the early access map and we're gonna be playing on this map on this video. Alright, let's get into it. Now this map reminds me so much of Hot of Star Wars Battlefront. Now for those of you guys that have played Battlefront, you guys know know what I'm talking about. Now this is the third time I've played on this map and this is the first time that I've got where it's all foggy and it's hard to see any of the enemies. Uh, so it's pretty cool, something different. So whenever you guys are trying to cap or take over the D flag, Right here up in this corner where I'm going to be at, this is the best place to take over and capture this flag. You have all this cover, you have this tree and this rock, you got enemies coming down right there. Enemy hit, grenade, enemy hit again with the grenade. We have Just going to sit here and you can take this flag from this point and you have all this cover to avoid enemy fire. Now right here I hear enemy running around, there it is. Sit here, camp, horse rider, and take the flag from this spot right here. Now I shouldn't have reloaded, I should have just kept at it. I kept shooting at the horse rider, but whatever, he took off. So here I'm gonna have an enemy trying to sneak him from behind us. Let's take him out. I'm trying to cap this flag. We have Got enemies objective. to the left of us running around right here over the trees. Got a couple guys shooting at us. If you can survive, you can just sit here in this corner. Just get up a little bit closer to the rock and you should be able to cap the flag. Got me a spot bonus right there. Let's see if I can heal real quick before I start getting back into the battle. Now once I'm ready, I can just go ahead and push into the D flag and start taking it from this spot. Have everything reloaded. The one going there run out of bullets. We have lost and here we start taking the flag. Now we have an enemy in here. I don't know where he's at. I'm taking fire from somewhere. And then somebody popped a smoke grenade. I hate these smoke grenades. You can't see anything through these. So I'm just gonna have to chill here and wait for the smoke to dissipate. And just hope that my teammates take out the enemy. He's somewhere on the flag. As you can see, it's one and one. And me and another guy. There's two. There's two and two now. One of them's down. I really don't know where he's at. He's probably over there on the other side of that log. And there's an enemy right there. And for some reason, I get taken out by the sniper that's on top of the hill. And then my teammate takes him off with the club hit to the back of the head. Once I spawn in on the D flag. I can either take the D or C flag, doesn't matter, they're pretty close by. But right here, as soon as you get on top of this hill, you're going to see all the enemies spawning in at their point. Where they spawn in at the beginning of the map. You're going to see this player underneath me. And me and this other other player that's right here. We're just going to be sh shooting rounds down range, hoping to get a lucky kill. But these LMGs, man, they suck at long range. These guns are good just for medium to close range. But a couple of Depression uh, shots would help out for the teammates, and then I also at the same time we can spot them. And here we're taking some sniper fire from where? Top of the hill, like always. Now there's not much I can do from this point. As you can see, you got all the enemies on top of these hills. I mean, this gun is pretty good at close to medium range, but at long range, unless I get lucky, you can see I'm getting 17 hit damage on these players. This gun is pretty hard to get even body shot. But all I can do is just hold them off from this point and spot them and hope that uh, my other teammates take them out after I spot them. This is a 
on the support class. I get these two shooting rounds down range. I get the suppression points and the swap points. I help my teammates. There I go, getting shot from the top of the hill again. Throw a grenade, and I'm getting shot again from this side. See, if you stand still, you're gonna get hit by a sniper or somebody rushing you. But man, this map is the sniper's heaven. If you're not careful, if somebody spots you, the sniper's gonna just turn around and take you out. Here, I gave me a lucky kill. The guy wasn't paying attention. As you can see, I haven't moved from the D flag. D flag and C flag are like the main points where all the main battles are going on. We got sniper fire from over there. So I just gotta keep moving back and forth. Do a little dance. Got some players right here. The recoil is pretty hard to control at a long distance with this gun. <laughs> I hear him getting shot from the top of the hill. I don't know where these guys spawned in from. They're like way behind our map over here. They just probably ran around and try to see if they can get some flanking points on us. So right here I decided to take C. See this player? He needs some ammo. I'm gonna resupply him. And there I get promoted. Level 86, we throw some grenades down the there. Charge. Give me a couple enemy hits for defending the flag. Couldn't get the kill. See this player aiming down sights down here. Got a player on the hill, enemy over here. That should have been a headshot. I don't know why, but I must have not hit him. We have lost objective. So here I got killed. This guy. I uh, respawned. Lava grenade in there. And give me a revenge kill right there. This guy that killed me before. Make sure I resupply my grenade that I just thrown down there. There's my player. My teammate, he needs some ammo. We have taken give him some. Usually when I see snipers, even if they're not my teammates, I'll drop some uh, ammo for them. Give me those resupply uh, points for helping them out. Now right here you see all these enemies popping out in these houses right here. Now behind the F flag is where they spawn in. If they start on this side of the map, that's where they're gonna spawn in. And you see, if, if you stand in this point right here, you can cap this flag. And you have this cover, part of the hill protecting you. Throw some grenades into those houses and give me some triple kills. You just have to sit here, resupply. And just keep throwing them some grenades down there. And hoping you get some kills. There's another one. Now this guy trying to flank me. Took him out. I died that last time. And after I respawn, we're going to go back and try to take the F flag. A couple enemies running around. Give me a lucky headshot right there. Or he was probably already damaged. Got another player there. Got another player right here. Give me those kills. I'm going to run up here. Try to regather myself. Right here, we're still at it. We're trying to take F flags. Got a couple of players on top of these hills. Got me a kill there. Try to resupply the sniper for the support class. See the grenade damage right there. And right here, they took the D flag after they took the F flag, so now we're gonna come back and try to take it. Here they took it again, and we're at it. Back and forth. Got a couple enemies rushing the hill right here. Now you should never go prone whenever you're taking some damage. You go prone, you're an easier target for the enemy to take you out. Right here, I got this sniper trying to rush me. Then I get the assist kill. After we took B flag, we're back at F guy out he's not paying attention to his surroundings if you have a good headset you can hear these guys footsteps you can hear the difference between your friendly footsteps and the enemy footsteps now right here this is a good spot where you can cap this flag like I said just hide behind this hill and you can cap this flag 
throw a couple grenades down in those houses and hope I can destroy them. Maybe there's a couple players hiding in there. Now right here you're going to see me looking around back and forth all around me because I can hear movement and footsteps. I'm trying to pay attention where all the gunfire is coming from. As soon as we take over F, I'm going back to D and help out my teammates. Now I'm just looking around, looking around because I can hear enemies or I can hear my players moving around. I can hear all their George. footsteps. I'm trying to pay, trying to figure out where it's coming from. But as soon as this flag is capped, I'm going back up with, to D flag. And once it's done, just rush up here. Taken objective Freddy. So it's me and another teammate here. There's some ammo. From another squad, and we have an enemy player on the D flag. I don't know where he's at. I'm trying to look for him. And then he gets his head taken out. So I don't know where he's at. He's either coming from this point, and there, right here, we got a horse rider. Got a couple of rounds into him. Then I cap the flag again, and then we have another enemy in here. Look what he does. He goes prone. He should never go prone. Got me a double kill. Right here, I should have never switch my weapon out, threw my grenade out, and got me some enemy kill points and then an enemy kill assist. Yeah, there was no way I was going to survive that. After I got me that double kill, there were still three more enemy players coming at me. I was going to survive that. So right here, we're going to take C. We already lost D, where I just died, and we're back at C. And we're going to see if we can cap this flag and then rush over to D. And I'm over here constantly looking at these hills, see if there's any snappers trying to look at us. Trying to take our heads out. Throw a couple grenades over there. Hope I give me a kill. Still capturing. We have taken objective charge. Couple enemies running here. And what happens? You get killed by a plane. There is no cover anywhere on this map from planes. So what do I do? I decide to get revenge. Try to take this plane out. But look what happened. We got a player that jumps out. Now I think he knows I'm over here. So I'm going to put a couple rounds into him. And I'm just going to chill here and wait for him to rush down here. And I'm going to take him out. You're going to see him peeking through these trees and the, behind these rocks and hills up here. But I'm right here. I'll, I'll wait. As long as you don't move, you'll be okay. But if a sniper sees you, he's going to take your head off. have lost objective, Freddy. how you get revenge. Right here I'm gonna start taking this plane. Put a couple rounds into him. That's the plane that killed me last. I'll make sure that he knows I'm here. So he doesn't come near us and start dropping bombs on us again. Yeah, now these planes are hard to take down if another player comes down. If you have two players shooting at him, you can pretty much take them out. One player by himself, it's pretty hard. And there he is parachuting down. Uh, let's see if he rushes me. I don't think so, he's just gonna run up the hill up there. We have taken objective button. Spot him. Now right here, see how far I'm shooting? I'm shooting all the way across the map. There's no way I'm gonna get hit on this player. He's too damn far away. So by now the round was pretty much over. It was pointless for me to even try to rush another flag. I will never make it. Here we won. Well, there you have it, people. I hope you guys liked the video. If you guys liked the video, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel. It really help me out. This is No Remorse, and I'm signing out. If you really look at yourself, you will be speechless. What happened to being doctors and teachers? What happened to being your brother's keeper? Nowadays, kids more work.